What's going on guys, Pokey Noel here, and today we have something a little special for you. <clears throat> These are, um, I got a uh, pickup today from uh, Pokey Steels, who's a guy who uh, started his own like little business where he's uh, able to sell <clears throat> uh, Pokemon products at under or close to retail. Um, it's like a members only kind of thing, and um, I was trying it out for the first time. Uh, just to see what the guy was all about and what we can uh, get. So, without further ado, um, I bought um, two PSA cards and two mystery boxes. Uh, one mystery box was valued at 50 bucks, and the other one was valued at 100 And the two other um, PSA cards, we'll, we'll get into those in a second because there's some, there's some juicy ones. And then um, also... Um, in the two mystery boxes, you had a chance at some PSA graded cards, um, and, uh, booster box, Japanese booster boxes, and ETB, like a whole bunch of things. Um, it came in one big box. Um, everything, I'm pretty sure, is in here. So, we're gonna go ahead and break this guy open and see what we got, guys. So, give me one second. All right just had to break the seal don't worry I didn't peek so let's whew, peeking so let's see what the uh, first thing was I'm pretty sure this is a PSA card here Make sure we have it backwards. Oh, okay, we have a Japanese card. And three, two, one. Whoa, oh, oh, are you kidding me? A PSA 8 Erica's Violet Plume from, I believe that's from Gym, gym Trainers or Gym Heroes, uh, is a Japanese Tamamushi. That's a pretty sick card, guys. I like Erica's Violet Plume. I like uh, Gym, Gym Heroes and uh, that set there. That is pretty cool. 1998. So that was before America. Pretty sure. Didn't Pokemon come out in America in 1999? Alright, let's see what we got here. Okay, it's backwards as well. Alright, let's see what the first one is. Alright. Three, two, one. Okay. All right. A 1999 Poliwag. PSA Gem Mint 10. This was actually one of the ones that I bought. I remember finding that one. And it's actually a pretty darn good price on it. So that is super sweet base set. Not first edition, but base set. All right. Uh, I think that's it for the PSA cards. Whoa! All right. It came out. <clears throat> Looks a lot better than a six, if you ask me. Okay, so there's a little, a little ding right there, but would that really knock it down to a six? No crazy scratches on it or anything. Hmm. That is a interesting, interesting grade on there. But sweet. And that is a base set two. Um, base set two thing. All right. And I'm pretty sure you guys already peeked. Looks like included in that mystery box was a shining fates and. A shiny star V pack. Um, I think this was one at 50 bucks or 100 bucks or something like that. And I'm pretty sure that this was at the the 50 buck, the 50 dollar uh, mystery box. Pretty sure about that. I gotta go look back over and see because the way he had it set up was he had multiple piles and. You chose between one through nine or one through eight, and um, you got a random pile. And I think one of the piles was a Shiny Fates ETB with 
Shiny Star V pack. But guys, it looks like um, we got some opening to do. So uh, we're going to save the Shiny Star V pack for last. And we're going to go ahead and get this ETB all ripped de rude. I hope everyone is having a fantastic day. Um, we've all seen this stuff before. If you guys missed it, check out my um, my live stream that we had some amazing technical difficulties. But um, you know, we made it through. That's what I was looking for. Seeing how this EV promos. UV promo came out. Doesn't look too bad. Still a little off center, but not terrible. Um, my first one that I opened, the the hollow had like a big circle or like a big spot right there where I guess they either didn't print or that this uh, when it was coming through the scanner it, it nicked it or something. But man, it was it was something bad. Um, I have it laying around here somewhere. It just don't want to get it and you guys know what else comes in here you got the chocolate dice you got the card sleeves and you got the, the dividers and you got the cool box yada 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 we've seen etb steve we're done shut up start opening packs okay i get it yeah it's okay charmander bless these packs bless them bless them bless them bless them okay done blessing all right let's get into it we've got 10 packs of shining fates and we're gonna see what we get code card for everybody i know how you guys love these code cards i can't go live one second without somebody where's the code cards where's the code cards well let me start first <laughs> all right for that energy we're gonna say water and we got fighting and we're gonna get into it with a rusted sword a flotzel a thwacky a coughing a trumpet a rowlet a toodle more pickle rillaboomy you join in the party once again once again, but hey, it's a VMAX, it's Rillaboom, we love them, we love all our shinies guys, and just even even Mr. Rillaboom, who, who shows up to the party, even when he's not invited, still gets to sleep. Moving on to that next pack, we've got the Toxtricity, Let's see if toxie has got anything for us today. Hey man, one pack and a VMAX hit? That is insane. That's an insane. Now this is the ETB that we got from the mystery box. So we're seeing if we we make up our hundred dollars or not. I'm gonna go with fire energy. Hey, we got the thwacky, ball guy, trumpish, more peckle, cacnea, horsey. See, I can say his name right. Q fan, choodle, shinx. Ram Rant V Max, two, two freaking V Maxes, back to back, in the Shining Fates ETB. This is some insanity here, insanity. But we all know that um, Shining Fates. I don't know. For me, it's been, it's been treating me pretty well. Um, haven't pulled like a whole bunch of cards that I wanted from it, but I did pull the Zard, and I've been pulling a lot of these guys. But I'm trying to fill out that shiny, um, shiny set because Miss uh, Pokenol, she really wants. Um, I think it's the shiny Yamper and and a couple other cards. We got the Shinks and a shiny Pulte guys right there on the back with a Manfrey on that Psychic Energy. I like the Pulte guys. Uh, I like Sinistee and Pulte guys. Those are, those are they're, they're neat. They're just neat little guys. There you go. Shiny. And that will be number 53 out of 122 out of the Shiny Volt. And it's kind of weird though because there's so many Shinies, but I've literally been pulling the same ones. It's, it's like my life is destined to just only pull. The certain shinies. It's like, but I want this shiny. No, no shiny for you. And I refuse. I am the type of guy 
<clears throat> and I am the collector who will refuse to buy singles. I'm a guy who really, really has to pull the cards by hand. I know. I know. It's not a uh, cheap nor a pleasant way to uh, fill out your set. But hey, I get to open packs and I'm happy about that. Cacnea. Gossipler. Fozel. Dreadnought. No, no, no. What are you guys doing this weekend? Did you guys get any battle styles? Did you guys get any of the VMAX boxes? I sure went out looking for the, the VMAX, the Blastoise and Venusaur VMAX boxes that were out. Couldn't find them. Not a chance. Um, I got some uh, Urshifu uh, V boxes there. And um, a couple blister packs, but that was about it. Didn't bother going to Target or Walmart because it was the same old story for me. Um, the one, the uh, one guy that I met that was waiting in line with me at the um, local card store told me that there was about thirty, about thirty to thirty-five people like in sleeping bags waiting for them to open and and I'm just like yeah no I'm not about that life Shnum! and the boss's orders not about it the the whole having to go camp outside just to beat scalpers or having to be ready to to, to pre-order things and stuff that's just not, not that's not the aspect of collecting that doesn't appeal to me um, I don't mind supporting local shops so I don't mind paying a little extra because I'm having that conveniency of being able to go to a store and peacefully pick out what I want and you know be done with it. Um, yeah, it makes it makes finding content a little harder. I do agree with that, but we it is what it is. I just can't can't go to Walmart and Target every day. <laughs> All right, here we go. Ooh, we got the Grookey. Snum! I've been wanting this one. Love it. Ew, and we got a Thrivio, the hollow. Shnommy nom. I love a baby shmom. And that is going to be number 33 out of 122. Sweet. Shiny snom. Who'd have thought? We're at four hits now. And we got four packs left can all of them be hitters I don't know I got two Charizard packs there and <clears throat> um, to me with Charizard pack arts um, I, I just consider them uh, dead packs because I never have I never get pulls out of them they're usually just uh, regular regular packs for Steven that's about it here we go we're gonna say water Woo! we had the water and we got cram rant the wacky Rusted Shield. I feel something in this pack. I'm feeling it good. More Pecco. Feels textured. Horsey. Remember last time I said that? Edgar and a Dalmize V. Yeah, last time I said that we pulled a freaking Zard and now we get a Dalmize. <laughs> and you're not textured, by the way. But hey, we will take you though. I love all the V cards, all the full art cards. Um, even just like the regular cards. Like, I mean, come on, guys. How can you not... People are like, oh, I didn't get anything good. Like, look how cool these artworks are, man. Like, that's back to the old hand-drawn style stuff. I mean, the Gossifleur. Like, come on. You guys just have your, your standards set way too high when it comes to opening packs, it feels like. I've seen so many people, they, they buy a new set, they rip open so many packs. And I'm like, appreciate the set, too. Don't, don't just rip through them just to get to that one card you want. Appreciate the sets as well. Dark energy. And we're going to go with the Thwacky. Rusted Shield. Rotom. Rowlet. More Pico with Nicket. Eevee. Gosflip. Yanma. Boomy. Alright. Cody Cods. Three to that front. Make it rain with the Luxio 
and we're gonna say fire. Got dark again. Luxio, Wacko, Rusted Shieldo, Cupendento, Chudalo, Yanmo, or Pekka O. O? Evo. Ooh, and that amazing rare Reshi Ram. Ooh, Mr. Poke Doll must be rubbing off on me. Um, if you guys don't know, uh, Poke Doll's another YouTuber, um, and he's freaking awesome. Um, he does a lot of breaks and stuff, um, and just makes really good content. But he has a knack for like every four or five packs that he opens of Shining Fates, he gets a um, an amazing rare. Last pack of magic for Shining Fates, guys. Let's pull some fire. Hey, that was out of a Zard pack too, so it made a made a liar out of me. Will it make a double liar out of me? Will it make Steven just seem like he just can't keep it together? Metal energy. Flazel. Press the sword. Luxio. Who's gonna take this party home? Nick it. Eevee. Gosler. Choodle. Team Yell Tao. Ooh, and DDV came to party for the last pack magic. That is super duper awesome. It's actually pretty darn cool. If you ask me. Well, that was a another Hidden Fates here. Another ETB. I think I've done six so far. Six or seven ETBs on this channel. Um, but that's okay. Because I actually do like uh, Shining Fates. But, guys, if you guys stuck around, please hit that like button. Please hit that subscribe button. Please share this with all your friends and family. Because guess what? It is time for Shiny Star V. The high class, premium Japanese packs. You get... Uh, 10 cards in this set. I don't know the card trick. I think it's one to the front. Yeah, one to the front. And we got our oil card. Yep. Milky. And there's your, there's that little thing there. Oh, cool. Grookey. That's neat. All right, here we go. Um, not, not saying the names because I forget a lot of names. I know that's like a hyper potion or, or a, Revive or something, not revive, but healing potion, that's it. Okay. Clarion Meowth, I believe. Eldegoss, I know that one. And that was our hit. Was the Eldegoss. Sweet! Alright guys, well that does it for the mystery box, the Poke Steals thing. Um Hope you guys are awesome. Hope you guys like. What do you guys think about uh, about this Erica Violet Bloom? That's that's pretty darn neat. That base set two Venusaur and a PSA six. Hey, that's still pretty dope. And then a PSA ten Poliwag. What? Come on. Um, all in all, um, I guess I felt like I got my money's worth for it. Um, can't really complain. The ETB was nice. Um, really wasn't expecting that uh, the ETB, but uh, got some pretty good hits out of there. Got the got the Ndidi, got, got the Relaboom, got the Cramorant, got the Amazing Rare, got the uh, Delmise, and then we got you know two shinies. Can't complain with that, guys. If you guys knew anything about Champion's Path, if you guys know how rough that set is, um, this is a refresh. Like uh, Shiny Stars, or not Shiny Star, but. <clears throat> Shining Face has kind of been a refreshing set for, for me personally um, just because I have a really, really bad luck pulling cards. Um, but hey, I still do it for fun. <clears throat> Again, it's not all about the hits and it's not all about the $500 Charizard or the you know $200 this or the whatever, whatever, you know. Like, I pulled this the other night and it was... I pulled it last night actually and it was absolutely amazing not worth a lot but I freaking love this card you know same thing with like a lot of the other ones you know um, those from ETBs but like like these two cards I freaking love as well and yeah I know I'm showing off the full art trainers and stuff because it's all I really kind of have near me but even just like the V's like just the normal regular cards too the artworks and stuff appreciate them you know we're all here to have fun. I'm here to have fun, and that's all that really matters. But anyway, guys, that does it for today's video. I hope y'all have a freaking awesome day. Um, this was actually a nice little treat to come home to. Um, 
So, especially after being at work and dealing with a lot of Karens and whatnot, it was a refreshing thing to come home. It was very nice. Um, but anyway, that does it today. I'm gonna shut up. I'm gonna let you guys go. I got dinner waiting for me. So, have a fantastic day. And like always, thank you so much.